hose on here and then pull that out just a little bit and that'll get draining in there. You also need to remove the cap so that it'll let the pressure out. Next thing you need to do is remove the, the oil filter. It should be on there just hand tight. Usually put a rag under it to catch any oil that might come out. It's the new Kawasaki oil filter that we'll be installing. I want to install it hand tight. So I just run it down. Take a rag. When the oil is done draining, you want to go ahead and close this valve. You know, up and then over. Go ahead and remove my hose I installed. Put that cap back on. Five gallon drum. But you pretty much just want to add about a quart and three quarters. Oh, the second quart, like one and three quarters quarts. So. Don't spin it all the way down, but just put it down there and then uh, check it. And you want your oil between these two hash marks, between the top line and the bottom line. So. Anytime it's in, in there, and you're good. And that's it.